Hello, this is Hawker Bean, and today we are going to r slash trends2. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now, let's get right into this. Fun fact for our, all of our NB slash transfem lesbians. The white stripe represents non-binary and transfem lesbians. As a matter of fact, the sunset flag itself was designed by Emily Gwen, a non-binary lesbian. More of the story? You're valid. And the turfs can seethe and cope over it. Sincerely, a bi-gender lesbian. Wonderful. <gasps> oh no, a spoiler. We have to pause. Be right back. Okay, it's good. Feel pretty safe about coming out to my family. Comes out to mom. She's she is supportive. Grandmother finds out and calls me mentally ill and uncivilized. Never again. Oh, I love when and Riot does that, don't you? Bessie accidentally induced a euphoria high, almost melted during algebra. I love that. When you don't voice train and your voice doesn't magically change overnight, it hurts. Start voice training. Already have a pretty effeminate and flexible voice. I sound like a lolly. I sound like a lolly. Yeah. I mean. Ow. My brain. Miyu has been going by Bridget for a year. I've decided we should go by Siri. Angry. <laughs> what are your goals in life? My goals? I don't know. Okay. Another one. Me, when I get called he, him, man, or boss by customers at work, that, that hurts. Realistic transition and goals? Nah. This... I don't know what that is. Fun fact! If your breasts are somewhere between 36C and 36D, then they weigh about the same as your brain. If you're above a D cup, you've probably got more boob than brain. I hope I never get it more boob than, than brain. Shout out to garlic bread. Gotta be one of my favorite genders. Me when someone mentions the fifth layer of the alphabet. <gasps> Gif. Transceiver. Transistor. Transmission. Transmission line. Transmoon. And broadcast. Do the... Oh my goodness, so many. You for you for my hair bouncing up and down as I walk. Good afternoon, sir. Oh, come on. 
One of my former friends has been going on about showing everyone how much she's changed since high school. I don't think she knows that I might be in her. I'm the one who changed the most since high school. Shy girl who wants to become a social media influencer? No, I am. Weird, nerdy, e, e guy who is now a right wing incel. Amateurs. What was that, punk? Amateurs. Me, a shy, awkward guy who became a girl. Luna's emotional support services include what you want in your comments, e.g. hugs, good girl slash good boy, head pads, etc. And I'll ask, can I call you a slash can I give you X? And you should reply with yes or no. If you say yes, I will do it. I don't know what that means, but you should probably see, I guess. More trends and... Oh, how cute. Sorry for a loop. Oh, that's another article that perfectly describes my trans experience. Oh, no. The eggs. I think they're gonna crack. I need to calm down. I'm very hard. I can't take sometimes. Compliments from cis women. Compliments from cis men. Compliments from NBs and other trans women. Compliments from trans men. Okay, this meme has been around for a long time. I am a lesbian. Good, so you have no possibilities of being pregnant. I might have? Hmm? My trans girlfriend. <laughs> Dr. Or Mark Zuckerberg. Elski, stop suing your, your patients. Call him the man he, he dropped the slapsuit against his trans patient. And there's a number. I really should have skipped this one, but it wasn't even... Uh... Well, actually, you know what? Screw this guy. Do it. Call that number. I'm going to leave this up for just a minute. Call that number. Go to the QR code, I don't care. The man he dropped it at stupid uh, 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 suit. Screw that guy. I didn't expect to run across that, but screw that guy. When starting HRT, you may experience new cravings. Sorry, I just don't like pickles. Blood, though. I mean, everyone's got a lot of blood. It's my birthday. Could you all uh, maybe perhaps even call me a birthday boy in masculine terms? My extended family has been dead naming and misgendering me the whole day. Help. I want to see your ELD support in the comments, but I just can't.
Gender envy from normal things? No. Writing instructor calling one of the mayors a good girl. Okay, what? <laughs> the VR chat pipeline, let's go. Hey, you should join me playing in VR chat. It's been so much fun and I've met some interesting people. Uh, I guess I could try it sometime? One week later. Okay, I got it installed now. Time to take a look, I guess. First step is to find an avatar that suits me. It's alright, I'm going, going to be a trans stereotype and pick, I don't know, Cackerel or something. I mean... I might. How did it come um, to this? How is this model I found that re I resonate the most with? The other models I resonated with were also like this. Am I only one step away from being a furry? I've seen some furries on the VR chat. Models are really good. VR chat uh, models in general are really good. Me thinking my parents will respect my identity this time I might talk to them. Hi, dead name. That that is painful. When the dysphoria doesn't go away immediately after you tell it to. Oh, that's fine. Okay, this next one's gonna have to be the last one. When you're early on tea and just admiring how different your throat feels. Oh, they got their apple. Okay. Anyway, that was r slash trans 2. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!